Let's say you accompany me to my medical appointment with my doctor and he or she, they take my blood pressure, they take all my vitals, they poke and prod, look in my ears and they say, well, you seem to be perfectly healthy to me and you're there to observe this and they show me all the data. If I then said, doctor, I'm dead. They show me all the physical signs of life and health and I say, I'm dead. Well, that's like what happens in one delusional disorder called Cotard's syndrome, where the person will insist they are either dead or they do not exist. That's just, like I said, an extreme example of a distorted tack. There is clear evidence of a living person, male breathing, heartbeat, blood pressure, et cetera. And I insist, doctor, I'm dead. So that's a tack that's clearly distorted away from the actual physical data of the body being alive, of a person talking, breathing, heart beating. So I don't want to talk about Cotard's example, except that's the best distorted tack I can come up with, the most extreme. So the tacks are distorted and they can be distorted by reinforcement and or punishment contingencies.